Here's a giant sentry safe. Ooh, right at the front. Ooh, and there's stuff in there. Ah, ready? Welcome, Welcome back, back to Treasure Hunt with Jesus, guys. guys. And today we have an epic storage unit video for you, so stay tuned. This little storage unit had some very secretive stuff in it. And we figured we might as well go through it, you know, the day of us going to the West Coast to destroy the Westicles. <laughs> so let's go see what we got in there. Let me tell you, it is epic. You don't want to miss it. Don't forget to like the video. Subscribe if you're new. Let's get it. So we just got back to this place and when, since we're leaving for the west coast in just a couple hours we figured we might as well get ready for them. So we paid $230 for a little tiny locker, a 4 by 5 230 bucks for it since we got to get used to wasting money for nothing. That's how the west coast rolls. So without further ado, let's see what we got. So I think you guys all see the real reason why we wanted this. There's a giant sentry safe. Ooh, it's right at the front. Ooh, and there's stuff in there. This is gonna have to wait till we get home. I, I haven't got to break a safe in a long time. I'm kind of excited about this. Where do we go from here? There's anywhere. a lot more stuff than I thought in this little four x five. Anywhere. Ugh. Um, a giant wooden chair. Okay. Very random, very, very random, but a wooden chair. Trash, ooh, look. We even got Fruit Loops, Jeremy some stuff. Some open Fruit Loops in there. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Who doesn't love open Fruit Loops? It's my favorite. Amazon Prime, this person's name on there. Yes, we can look them up. My favorite part. Uh, let's see, what is this? Uh, I'll just say umbrella. I'm not gonna lie, I thought saw it sitting there. It looked like a sleeve, like I was hoping there was hiding something inside of it, but it doesn't look like it. This looks like it's gonna be all shoes. Ooh, let's set it down here. Yeah, look at that. Just, just coming out there. Oh, what are these shoes? Oh, one of these Ooh, look at those. My mom actually doesn't have this pair. And they're both in there. What size does she wear? Seven, I think. At least say seven. Six. Six. Maybe. <laughs> she'll, be, she'll be like, I'll squeeze my foot in there. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Hey, if I get a nice pair of Uggs, I'll be happy. I get the break and save. She gets a new pair of Uggs, that's a win. Uh, a mat, or one of those things that go over the window? Or, I don't know. It's a beach mat. Beach mat, that's what I meant. Totally. Umbrella? Uh, let's see. Ugh. Eve. Whole thing full of clothes here. Whatever, we'll look this up in a little bit. You guys know the main reason we bought this unit right there. Let's see. This got something in it. What is it? There's bugs in there. Huh? There's bugs. There's bugs? Yeah, I see them flying. They're like little boxes. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's why. Look at it. That's just somebody's food. Ew, why would you store this? How many times have we asked ourselves that on a daily basis by cleaning our storage unit? You know, why would you pay to store this? Why would you pay to store this? Why would you pay to store that? Always the question. All right, what's in this thing? A radio, what is that? Ooh, a VR set. That's nice. I mean, it might be a five below one, I can't tell. Look at the brand on there, ONN. Some of them are like $60, some of them are five below, so we'll figure that out. Where do we go from here? Giant clipboard. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, you smell it? It's sand, probably mildew for sucking wet. I feel like somebody just got back from the beach and like, do you want to take this stuff home? No, I want to just throw it in a storage unit and never pay it. Sounds good. All right. That. Mm. This all closed. Look, oh, some dress shoes. Give me a good brand. Give me a good brand. All that's in there is a horseshoe. <laughs> what does that tell me? I don't know. But that. What's in the book bag? Ooh. What is that? 
her sprite. You see that? What do you think's in there? Money? Lots of cards though. Let's see if we find any gift cards. Gift cards are all oh, I see somebody's ID. Does it match the name on the other thing? Oh yes it does. There's two ID there's three IDs. Is it all the same person? Yes, okay. He looks far away from here. I wonder why he's storing here, if he still that address, but it looks like all bank cards other than that. But at least we have information to look the guy up one now. See if there's anything else in the bag. Ooh, that smells like weed. Holy crap. What do you think's in here? Ooh, jewelry. Ooh, something's gonna be real. Something hot. Oh, is that a clash ring? That's a clash ring from 88. Oh, yeah. What is it, gold? Come on. Where is it at? Where is the marking in there? 18 karat gold. Let me see. Hit the light down a little bit more. 18 karat. Oh, yeah. Now, what do you think that is? You think it's a sapphire, actually? Hopefully. <laughs> That's nice. That's a good start. This looks. The rest of it does not look real. Well, I don't know. I mean, if they're going to put one real thing in there. It might just be like me. I bought my class ring in high school. It's still just sitting in my drawer, so I don't know why. What do you think we got in here? An old phone. Yay. Randomness. And pills. What kind of pills do we have? Let's see. Let's see. G-A-B-A-P-N-T-I-N. Gabentin? I don't know what that is. Check up here too. Nothing in here. Nothing. So hey, class ring, that's nice. All right, let me get this bag down, I'll be right back. Let's see what's in this pink thing now. Probably closed, but we gotta look through it anyway. Ooh, Olympian, oh, it's a yearbook from 85. Signed and everything. Probably, I know some people used to sell these, but it's all signed on the inside. I'll probably just turn that in at the front. Hopefully they can get it back to the guy. Ugh, what kind of coat we got here? Big brands, big brands, big brands. We're not gonna have a chance to sell any of this stuff or list any of it, or even do a recap for that matter, but hey, we'll go through it for you. What does that say? Gallery, collect, collection gallery. Hopefully big money. Anything else in here? Just random clothes. There's something at the bottom or is that the design of the suitcase? No, just more clothes. Nothing too exciting. All right, lots of totes. Looks like a paperwork junk one, but Let's see. Oh, it does not smell good in there, I'll tell you that. Coffee grinder. I mean, just tons and tons of paperwork. That's literally it, tons of paperwork they'll have to go through. After we get back from crushing the West Coast, we'll have something to do. More coffee, a wrench. Gosh, this year just smells like weed though. Like I smell so much weed in here. Bunch of clothes. Some of them might be new. It looks like there's tags on a few of them, but I don't know. I also see Walmart receipts, so there might be Walmart clothes. I'm not sure. What's in this sucker? Can we go through this? There's nothing in it anyway, so. Doesn't matter. Ugh. Oops. Bed sheets, my favorite. Uh, there's a lot more than I thought was gonna be in this little thing. We brought Toiletry. the we brought the van or car because I was like, it's a four by five, can't be too packed. Should have brought the van. Yeah, probably should have. <laughs> but it is what it is at this point. Laptop charger. 
about it in there. Really, it looks like so far we're relying on the safe and the class ring. Where do we go from here? Huh? It's in the corner. This? Yeah. Right, this is a clothes bag. What else do we got? There's gotta be some value in here somewhere. Um, I don't see it if there is. Doesn't look like much. Does not look like much at all. Yeah, that's it. Nothing. Let's get this one out the way as well. Ugh. Ugh. Oh yeah. That's Can you imagine this much stuff is fitting in that 5x4? That's crazy. It doesn't even look like a 5x4. A lot of little stuff in that little thing. Nothing here. Ugh. Ew, trash. What? All that corner's trash. Oh. Ugh. Come here. That one's got some weight to it. Let's see what we got. Nothing. And what is all this? Are these all yearbooks? Yep. Four yearbooks. And a gun. <laughs> Kinda. What else? Is that it? There's gotta be weed somewhere in here. Like I'm telling you, like I, the smell of weed is so strong. You're a little baby. If there's not, I will actually be blown away. That is all that's in there, unfortunately. Let's get this one out the way. Ugh. Running out of space. All right. Yeah. Something in there. Oh, look at that. It's perfect for the plane. <laughs> now it's. Well, that's what we gotta do at this point. We're kind of in a rush. Like I said, I bought this unit because it was a 4x5, and I was like, there just can't be much in there. It should be a quick clean out. But are they proving me wrong? What is all this stuff? Completely no. random junk. Let's look in this suitcase first. Ugh. Ugh. It was safe. Or not a safe. Why did I say safe? Sorry. Jeff Ravine. It's a suit. See, this is my problem. I'm going through all this stuff and the only thing that's contemplating and going through my head is what's in there. That's it. Nothing else. Ugh. One more suitcase back here. All right. The last bag here. Let's see if there's something else in here. Hopefully. If not, well, then we're relying... Oh, it's locked? Oh, no, it's just the riding lock. Then we're relying on the safe and the ring. Well, we definitely could have also missed some stuff because we have not really checked thoroughly for this one because we have very little time. And... Doesn't look like there's no value in here. And as far as the rest of the unit goes, it doesn't look like there's nothing either. So, we're going to get everything together. And fingers crossed for us. Let's hope. Let's, let's just, just hope. This all fits in a car one trip. We really, really don't have time for two trips. But try to get it home and then see where we can go from there. See you then. Guys, I've been fiddling with this thing the whole way home. Cannot get into it. The electric part doesn't work. Normally, we would take a more tactical approach to this. But we have about 30 minutes before we have to leave to go to the airport to go crush the West Coast. So, we got to go East Coast on the safe. Let's hope. Whatever that is. Is not some like you know ancient artifact that's worth ten million dollars. <laughs> oh, ah, ready? No, I took the magnets off. The magnets came off. No. Oh. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. It's like it's kind of off. Keep going. Ready? Did that do it? Throw it on like the corner. No, it broke it. It's coming off slowly. Throw it one more time. One more time should do it. That's how safe they are, Sentry. <laughs> All you gotta do yeah. is slam it a few times. Ready? Uh, almost. Oh, come on, the batteries are flying out. 
I can see a little key pad in there. Ready? Still no? Ah, so All right, right. Let's go. We're going hawk mode. Yeah, do it that way. Okay. Huh? Okay. Ready? There we go. Yeah. You ready? So first things first. I wonder if this is part of the keypad or... Hard drive. Hard drive. No, that's a 500 gig hard drive. Mm. This one's a. What the heck could be on these if they were in a safe? 120 gig hard drive. Probably. I got an idea, <laughs> and it's probably not appropriate for YouTube, but it's just a guess. What is this? What? Does nothing. Okay. <laughs> um. I don't want to molest this thing, but. I feel like something's in here. Why? <laughs> Why is that in a safe? <laughs> Another one. That's a terabyte. Nice. One terabyte hard drive. So we got one terabyte, 500 gigs, and 120 gigs, we said? I don't remember. 120 gigs. So we have 1.6 terabytes worth of stuff right now. I hear money. Money? Oh my God, there's hard drives in there too. Really? More. Alright. Yep. Stars! <laughs> Those are the ones that used to go on the ceiling. I remember these. <laughs> Piece, secret of pieces of paper. A veterinarian referral center? Boring. Next! Million dollars? Yes, yeah, million dollars, million dollars, million dollars, million dollars, million dollars. Oh. Nam, 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 million dollars. That's where the smell's coming from. Whoa. That's weed. Holy, smell it! <laughs> smell that! Oh! That's... That's probably the strongest we've ever smelled it. In any unit. Um... All my pothead friends out there, I'm sorry, but... <laughs> probably gonna throw it away. Yeah. Keep going. One terabyte again. We don't smoke. I don't smoke. Nothing against people to do, so they don't get triggered. What is this one? I don't say a size on that. I Another hard drive. Piece. I don't know. I gotta plug them up. There's so many hard drives in here. Look at this. Another hard drive. Disk drive. I mean, look at the pile of these things. We probably broke half of them, but <laughs> like that. Yeah. Well, I don't think that's that's 250 <laughs> gigs too. 3,000 gigabytes. That's three terabytes. Why don't just just put three terabytes? What is this? Hey! What? Is that the reader? Is it? That's a whole um, hard drive right here. Is it? Looks like it. Oh, yeah it is. Huh? 1.5 terabytes. <laughs> I mean, we can hook these up still see what's on them. You guys need to know what's on them like me? <laughs> Let us know. Maybe we'll do a video if it's YouTube appropriate yeah. and go through the whole thing. But I wonder if that's what you plug up to your computer to read them. I have no Probably idea. <laughs> There's another hard drive. Look at all these hard drives. I mean, something's up here. There's got to be a reason you lock these up. Another hard drive. That looks like it might be part of the safe. And this one is 160 gigs. So, I mean, you got like close to 10 gigabytes or 10 terabytes of storage there, which is ridiculous. Ooh, more weed. Oh, flash drives. Nice. Flash drives and SD cards. Oh, yeah. We got to see what's on these. Maybe that'll give us a hint of what's on the um, megabyte hard drive. 32 gig hard drive or um, SD card right there. And this is a thing you plug in USB and you can read the SD cards directly. Okay. And one nickel. Yeah, a nickel. Ooh, it's broken. That's why. Or did we do that? Uh, we <laughs> <laughs> we might have broke it. I don't know. Oh, here comes the yard guy. Not and sure. With his weed whacker. But all right. So before the guys come and clean the yard. Weed and tons of hard drives. So let's see what's on these. We can at least see what's on these before we go. But the hard drives are gonna have to wait until we get back from the West Coast, unfortunately. So we'll see it then. All right, now that the storage unit's done being cleaned out, we are on the road to the airport, getting on the plane in just a couple hours to come crush the West Coast. You guys have no chance. You, sh you should have made a stop when you had a chance. Now we're on the way. There's no turning back. You guys are gonna be slaughtered in your own territory. And look where we're at, Dulles Airport. Let's get in there and smash the West Coast. Airport security, down. Next step, flight. Next step, arriving California. <laughs> Next step, 
destroy the West Coast. Look at the planes over there. Oh yeah. We're here. It's real now. We're in competition mode here to destroy <laughs> East Side. <laughs> All right guys, so guess what? We are officially in the hotel, Dixon, California. And if you're wondering, why did you guys stay in Dixon, California? If you did not watch Smosh around 2013, then you missed the golden age of YouTube. And if you did, you know exactly why we're staying in Dixon, California. Make sure if you're one of those people, don't make us feel alone. Put it down in the comments. But guess what? You see this? This is an East Coast foot, a big East Coast foot, they like to point out, on West Coast soil over for you guys now you have no shot at all but anyway guys that's gonna be it for this i'm not sure we're gonna do a recap but we're kind of 2400 miles away from home so thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy it make sure you leave it a big fat thumbs up if you're not already hit that subscribe button for awesome treasure hunting videos all the time and if you do want to follow us on our social media links are going to be on screen just click links down in the description below make sure you follow us on whatever you have thank you so much for watching and until next time peace out